Welcome to Mother Daughter Projects. I'm Steph. I'm Vicki. And today we're going to show you how we installed this really cool wood grain artwork. This is from a company called Nano Leaf, and they've been around for about 10 years. And actually, nine of those 10 years, Steph has been wanting that in her house. So in 2021, they came out with this wood grain version, and she's like, that's the one I want. So she ordered it, and we put it up, and she loves it. <laughs> I do too, actually. Yeah. Uh, so come join us as we show you how we got this installed, and wait till the end because we're going to show you some of the smart features and what we learned. This space right above my bar is the perfect location for the nano leaf elements and will complement our PVC artwork nicely. I laid out two measuring tapes to the dimensions of the space, then just started trying out different configurations for the panels. In the packaging, nano leaf includes a few suggestions. I started adding the linkers between some panels. Then I prepped the location and removed the backing from three panels. Here's the linker connecting the panel and the controller. Mom held the middle panel in place so I knew where the first three panels needed to be. Then I secured them in place. Each panel needs to be pushed in place using a circular motion for 30 seconds. I continue to add linkers and panels. It was helpful to have a picture of the design from the floor in case I forgot where each panel was supposed to go. Time to test it out. It looks so cool! Don't mind the flicker, that's what happens when you film LED lights, but it doesn't do that in person. Mom painted the white cable gray to blend in with the background. Love it, but I wanted a little more. <laughs> so I ordered an expansion pack, which is three more panels. It comes with the same linkers as before, but not power as it just connects to what I already have in place. I use gaff tape to test the location and show mom where I thought the panel should go. We got the plan made and added them in place. And now let's see them dance to some royalty free music. What we learned! Now this is a smart product, meaning that you do need a smartphone to get this set up, but it's really, really simple. It walks you through all the steps to do that. What's neat is in the Nano Leap app, they have some presets that you just click on and it makes this light up in different ways. Um, but you can also completely customize it to exactly how you want it. But we have it set up pretty much on the or sunbeam setting and it does rhythm, so it adjusts to, it will, change depending on the noise in the room so uh, us talking it's adjusting to that which is pretty the, cool the dog barking or yes. music when that's playing is so it just it listens and it moves and it's great yeah and since it's smart you can actually control all the features in the app and i can set up a schedule so it automatically comes on at a certain time goes off at a certain time and it can change the presets as well at certain times so it's really nice and pretty smart and it works with all of the um, apple google and alexa products there's also a little control panel on there, which you can see, and we actually had it in a different location, and you can move it anywhere, and we just moved it down a little lower so we can just reach over there. If you don't want to get your phone out, you can actually just turn it off and on with the little button panel. Exactly. There is a wood grain look to these, and so when I was putting them up, I was actually being mindful of that to make sure the wood grains kind of match or complement each other, so keep that in mind when installing. And also, while you're installing this, um, this is very customizable, but I would say this is more of a set it and forget it kind of thing, because uh, they are stuck up there. They're not easily removed. So, I mean, you could easily remove it, but then you have to put a new like sticker pad on it. And so I would say kind of adjust it on the floor first, get the pattern you like, and then put it up there and enjoy the look of it. Well, another thing you could actually do is cut paper patterns and you could stick those up with some tape and just arrange that until you get what you like and then put your permanent nano leaves up in place. Like mom said, Nano Leaf has been around for about 10 years and they make lots of different products that light up like this. Um, and what I liked about this one is this, when it's off, it still has a cool look to it. It has the wood grain look and it looks like wood artwork um, up there. And then when someone starts to talk, then it lights up and it's like, wow, the pow effect. So, um, so that's kind of why I really like this one. And like I said, this is called Nano Leaf Elements, but they make a lot of different kinds. We'll put links to those below. 
we did have a little trouble when we first plugged them in and they didn't light up and we did a little troubleshooting and we just realized we hadn't put them in tight enough. So we would recommend when you're putting those up, go ahead and plug it in. So as you add them and they light up, then you know you've done it right. Thank you for joining us. We really love this. Let us know in the comments below what you think of this. Um, and if you want to see more projects from us, be sure to visit us at motherdaughterprojects.com. And make sure you subscribe right here on YouTube, click the bell, and you'll be notified of all our new projects. Thanks for joining. Bye. Bye.